crime director. If the subject fails to respond, I don't need you to remind me what is at stake. My apologies, sir. I didn't mean to. Girl was black, Gemini. She must. Do you think she has any idea how important she is? Hardly. How could she know? The existence of evolved humans has always been a closely guarded secret. The rise of a dominant new species, not just as Dr. Suresh predicted, a brave new world. Indeed. The one that will soon have no room left in it for humanity. We must do our best what we hope she is. Hello again, Dahlia. Where's my sister? <laughs> is that any way to greet your host? I haven't seen her in two days, and I want to know why. If you touch one hair on her head, I swear. You need to focus, Dahlia. Breathe. Take a moment to remember how lucky you are. Lucky? I'm a prisoner here. What do you think your life would be like on the outside? An orphan girl with an evolved power. They treat you like a monster. But not here. At the quarry, we celebrate our differences. You mean you experiment on them? Perhaps your sister would make a more suitable test subject. No, I'll do it. Just leave her out of this. That's what we like to hear. Let's get started. Commencing test sequence one. Basic movement systems activated. That's it, Dahlia. Now, you need to do a quick vision test. Look up to the observation window, please. Slow and steady, Dahlia. All right, just look up here at the window and we can move on to the good stuff. Okay, Dahlia, let's take it from the top, nice and slow. When a floor tile lights up, walk over to it as quickly as possible. Come on, Dahlia, don't be resistant. Walk onto the white square. Now, just one more diagnostic test, and we can begin studying your abilities. When a platform illuminates, jump on top of it. I know it seems high, Dahlia, but you're more than capable of doing this. Just jump onto the platform. Very good, see? You're a natural. Okay, now step through the door and we can begin sequence two. Please, Dahlia, walk through the door for me. Pneumatic doorway mechanisms activated. Please step forward into the testing chamber, Dahlia. Okay, Dahlia, let's try one more warm-up. See that red door across the room? I want you to open it, and I'm not going to tell you how. Well done, Dahlia. Now, please, step through the open door. Did you really think it would be that easy? Any human could do what you just tried. I need you to prove that you're special. Your whole life, people have been calling you different. A freak. How did that make you feel, Dahlia? Take a wild guess. Scared? Alone? More like pissed off. Good. Use that anger. Bottle it up and channel it into your hands. Uh, right, uh, as Mr. Mason said, why don't you try using that box to help you exit the room? Not that I have much experience with telekinesis, but I, 
I am fairly certain that you just envision yourself picking up the box and whoosh, you're picking it up. Yes, that's it. Now use it to get yourself out of the room. There. Satisfied? Excellent, Dahlia. Your telekinetic abilities are coming along quite nicely. Now step through the door, and we'll begin sequence three. Commencing test sequence three. Advanced telekinesis systems activated. Just like last time, Dahlia, step forward into the chamber. Now for something more challenging. Let's see if you can use your abilities to exit the room without our help. You do realize the door is like <laughs> 10 feet in the air. Don't get smart with me, Dahlia. If it was easy, anyone could do it. I still remember the day I discovered my abilities. We had just moved into that crappy foster home, and our new big brother, Steve, thought it'd be fun to shove my sister off the balcony to see if she could fly. I could see her tumbling, and then all of a sudden, I could see myself catching her in my mind. And just like that, she stopped. At first, Steve thought she was the Evo, but it was me. I was different. Excellent work, Daya. You're getting the hang of it now. 